Hey everyone, today I'm here to show you this natural, minimal makeup look. There's no highlighter, no lashes, it's five minutes, it's very easy, and stay tuned if you want to see how I got it. Yes. So the first thing you want to do is prime your face. Priming is very important. It fills your pores to provide a smooth base for the rest of your makeup. So you want to do that. I'm using the Maybelline Baby Skin Primer. Um, and yeah, it's really good. Well, actually, I lied. It's not that good. Um, I'm going, and because of that reason, I'm going to set this primer with a translucent powder so that it doesn't budge it doesn't get slippery or anything like that because it's silicone based so yeah you want to fix that so I'm, I'm I, it looks like I'm putting on a lot but I'm just gonna make that cover all my face if that makes sense the foundation I'm using is the Maybelline fit me foundation in the color 360 mocha it is the dewy smooth line i really love this foundation and i'm putting this on with a real techniques beauty sponge um i put on a, a lot i know i shouldn't have done that but whatever you know um, the tip that I can give beginners in, in makeup is blending. Blending is very, very, very important. Um, I look really, I, you see the face I made. I know I look really orange. I know I put on a lot in that moment, but you know what? It's okay because I'm going to blend my life away. I'm just going to keep on blending and blending until it, it looks like it's my skin. Until the orange, is, orange color goes away, I'm just going to keep on blending and just, now you see in this clip right here that I look decent. So, and then I'm blending it out some more with a brush. So, it's okay. If you mess up, it's okay because you can blend. Just blend that. Right here, this is the Ruby Mineral, Ruby Kisses Mineral Powder in the color Ebony. And I'm using that to just chisel out my cheekbones and add some dimension to my face um i'm not gonna be highlighting in this video just because that's too much so too much for work that's where i was going i was going to work so i'm chiseling my cheeks my nose um my forehead just making sure that oh, i'm all chiseled you know and i'm going to run this over my eyelids just to do like it's kind of a, a trick I use for a fake um, a fake eyeshadow so yes blend your life away blend 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 everything that you put on your face so you look decent so you don't look a hot mess okay honey all right all right so the next thing i'm going to do is use this covergirl bronzer this is really 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 orange i remember when i used it way too much and i just looked a hot mess so now i use it as a blush just because i don't know it's too orange i don't like it but i love it as a blush and it has sparkles in it so it it fits that um purpose really well so you want to put that in the places you put your uh, contour and I kind of put it over my contour too. I lied. I kind of use it as a bronzer too. Whatever Get it how you live now. I'm doing my eyebrows with a Jordana midnight brown pencil Um, I love this thing. It's three dollars at Walgreens. It's really 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 good. I love it. Love it. Love it. Okay um I'm not going to be highlighting my eyebrows either just because the foundation kind of did that for me as you can see. Uh, I'm putting on mascara, my bad. I'm going to be setting my face. Okay, I didn't include it in this um, video because I guess I lost it in editing. But I used the uh, Maybelline Fit Me Powder to, s to set my face with that. And now I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Infallible uh, Makeup Setting Spray to um make sure i don't look powdery or anything and this is the finished look thank you guys so much for watching please like comment and subscribe and i will be back with another video very soon